I'm Emma Chamberlain, co-founder of Chamberlain Coffee, and today I'm going to be making, big shocker, a coffee. I'm on the go today, so I'm going to use a to-go cup, okay? I need a lot of ice. I'll explain later. So, you might be looking at me and thinking, well, that's a little kid. I'm 22, so relax. I started Chamberlain Coffee when I was about 18 or 19 because I, I had a really genuine passion for coffee. But on top of that, through my YouTube channel, I became known as a coffee drinker. I need to do a double shot. So we're doing another one or else it's not gonna be the right. It just will be wrong. It's sort of, was a natural thing to, to start a coffee company. But one of the main challenges was being young. You know, I, I'm still in a lot of ways, even now, a kid. I, I don't have a lot of life experience. I didn't go to college. What gives me the credential to start a company? But I think, you know, if you have an idea and if you're passionate about something, you might as well try it. Hold on. Nice. You have to get the espresso cold first. What's helped me manage my imposter syndrome about starting a company at such a young age is accepting the fact that no one knows how to do everything. And what I bring to the table is, is valuable. It's, it's a new perspective on coffee. It's a new feeling, you know? It's doing coffee in a, in a different way. I still struggle at times with feeling, actually not as much anymore. You know what, not as much anymore. I've really come to terms with what I'm able to bring to the table, entrepreneurially, uh -huh, if that's even a word. And now my coffee is done. I didn't fill it up all the way because this is just like the perfect balance. But if I filled it up all the way, it would be too much milk. I don't know. It's really good. I mean, of course it's good. <laughs> 